All right. Um, I heard guys in Rumble, YouTube. Do you hear me? Breaking news. This is the BBC. We just receive a lot of emoji from the Muslims around the world. They are posting the flag of Israel, celebrating the great news. You can't believe it. Those are Muslims, by the way. Look, look, look. Those are Muslims. Muslims celebrating the news that Hassan Nasrallah is being smoked. Can you believe it? You got to leave it, leave it. You got to believe it, leave it. Leave it. Yeah, that's why I say in news. I don't know. You know, I, I, let me call it because in since I am from the Mossad, let me call Netanyahu. Hey, Neta. I call him Neta, by the way, because like we are friends, you know. Hey, Neta, how are you? Who? Oh, come on, Neta. Oh, come on, damn, from the people, you know. Don't uh, don't play now game you do not know me. No, listen. No, you want to blow up my cover. It's okay. It's all right. No, no, nobody is listening. Only YouTube and Rumble and Discord and... Yeah, don't worry about it. It's uh, take it easy. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. So what happened with this? Uh, did you guys uh, cook them? Really? No way. It's not you. Who did it? His wife Aisha. His sha. Yeah, they don't have a wife Aisha. They don't even they hate Aisha. What are you talking about? Oh, okay. Yeah, that or oh, all right. Aisha is the password. Uh uh uh. uh okay. You don't wanna, guys. Just between us, this is language you guys don't uh, don't understand. All right, look at this. Oh boy, there's some. They are Hezbollah. They are trying to support Nasrallah in that in the chat. <clears throat> uh, like this guy saying, "Labbaika Nasrallah." Praise be to Allah for you, and we are here for you, Nasrallah. And then this guy, he said, "Here, I'm going to give uh, candies." Uh, you know, in everywhere around. All right. Uh, uh, Emily here, she is saying, all them become is Israeli, which means those Arab, they are because they are happy. <laughs> it's hard to believe. Now. Let me see. Let me see the news. Is it really wrong? Is it true? I hope so. That would be fun. But based on what we see, it looks like it is true. Hold on, what a time now. All right, we still we have some time. <clears throat> All right, because there is a uh, there is a way to find out. Look, guys, look, they have the picture of Hassan Nasrallah in the screen. I like this image here. Maybe I should have it in the screen. So here it says, look. They have the image of him, look. and they put him in the top on the rubbish. Obviously, still they are saying that Hezbollah is uh, uh, like did not mention what happened to to him yet. All right, and they are inviting. Those, this is where the attack happened. It looked like he was hiding here. Oh, you mosquito, you were hiding here. Let us go back to that uh, chat. <laughs> Petito, you want to play with the Jews, you idiot? Monkey, here we go. You, they cooked you. You got what you deserve. Let us see Israeli news. Hold on. <coughs> Yeah, even CNN, even at Jazeera. At Jazeera, no, they're saying that. Uh, hold on. Yeah. Even the Times for Israel is mentioning that. Look, let me show you. What Quran now, you idiot? Go away. They give us a break from the Quran now. <clears throat> All right. Do you see what it says? Hebrew media reports growing Israel assessment Nasrallah killed in Beirut strike. 
Do you see it? Betito. Hassan Nasrallah. Soon, officially, always by the way, in the beginning they refused to say it happened. Always in the beginning, anyone they, they killed, you know. They they say, what page I'm watching? I don't watch pages. Pages watch me. I'm very humble. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm so happy, guys. I can honestly, I can, even though I'm really tired, but I hope this is true. That's really good. You know what? I'm going to make you buy me baklava. What do you think about that? <laughs> I will not buy you. And don't forget, I want a chair with massage, okay? Massage a chair, okay? Because I love you. I love you. <laughs> oh boy look at this hold on hold on let me see the news more news what i'm just trying to avoid copy you know the strike you know like royalties you know you know you know the thing you know the thing yeah but look like it is it is what it is it's uh, you know it happened uh wow I will never argue with Netanyahu anymore from now on. That's it. I will not even talk about him. Uh huh. Let us see. Yeah, even Jerusalem Paul saying the same. I see that in Jerusalem Post. So this is no kidding. And you know, we know that in Israel, they don't say things. They are not the same as Arabic TV stations. They say things does not even exist. They will not say that unless it is real. Yeah. So let us hope not only injured, let us hope that he is cooked. Will be funny. Huh? Who is here happy with me? Give me one if you're happy. I want to make tea, guys. Maybe I need to make coffee. Because this will help me not to feel hungry. What, Mabrook? That's it. We need baklava. And now you will see somebody who is a Christian. He will say to you, Christian Prince, is that what Christ taught you? Celebrate the death of a human being? This is a wicked devil. He killed a lot of people. Don't give don't even think about it. Don't give me speeches. Alright? This faith is come back. Do you know how many children get killed? Do you know how many women? Do you know how many? Not only in not only in Israel. No, this is not only about it. those their blood is everywhere. The, the blood in their hand is everywhere. Even the attack in Argentina in the synagogue, killing more than 250 Jews in one second, it was done by him. Even the war in Bosnia, they sent fighters to fight against the Christians, in, in against the Serbian, against the, 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 the Christian in Bosnia, against the Croatian, their blood, their hand, in, in everywhere. All right? Very filthy. I'm trying to find... I can put the screen, the video, but you know, we, we risk it by having a, a copy strike, you know. They will find, I am showing now, seeing the image, hold on, let me show you the images for a second, I don't think that will affect. Uh, so if, look, look at the chat, it's going crazy, guys, look at this, look at this. <laughs> there are two parties. So this is where Nasrallah being smoked. Do you see now? Oh, they are looking for him. They have the, this escalator. Like, look for him. I found his finger. I found his toes. So they are playing his video like when he was alive. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah, yeah, Planet Tree. We will remember you now. Look how many bodyguard. You, can, you think you can protect yourself, Potato? They got you. Yeah, yeah. Going back to the chat. Oh, boy. I will drive you crazy with this chat. Let me switch. Hebrew media report growing Israel assessment Nasrallah. Ah, oh, there's a new update. Hold on. What happened? 
Uh, this is just commercial. All right. Israeli official confirm the toll strike target Lebanese terror chief. Yeah, you see, it's confirmed. You see it? It's not. It's not the news only. It's very hard to imagine him coming out alive. God knows what kind of weapon they use. Maybe the one I, I told them how to. Uh, by the way, because we are the Arab, we are the one who taught those Jews how to make a weapon. They don't know how to make it. You know that those Jews in the old day they have a guy. His name is David. He used to use rocks. Yeah. So like, uh, hey David, come on. Time to update. So we, the Arab, we took uh, those Jews to the side and we start teaching them how to make firework. They didn't know how to do it. The score stopped. Huh? How come? I did not close it. Okay, let me open it again. Breaking news. Assassinated. All right. I don't know why it stopped. Am I heard, guys, in uh, Discord? Do you hear me, people, in Discord? You hear me? So what if you hear me? You guys are very funny. You make a big story about anything. I say, do you hear me? You say yes. Even when you don't hear me, you say no. How you don't hear me, you say no. How you know even what I'm asking if you don't hear me? Hmm? This is what I do with Abdul. I usually do this with her. that guy. He says, I don't have a mic. I said, come and debate me. He said, I don't have a mic. I said, okay, if you don't have a mic, give me one in the chat. He typed one. <laughs> So, so you know, not a mic. You don't have a speaker. You don't have a speaker. I cannot hear you. I don't have a speaker. I don't even have a speaker. You know? Okay, if you don't have a speaker, put one in the... He put one. Potatoes. All right, let's see what is the last update in news. Let me share with you the screen here, guys. Like you see in Discord, I can share the... Actually, the news. Uh, the other news. Hold on, hold on. Let me see how I can do that. Give me a second. Maybe we can share. We go to Fox News. They are talking about hurricane, Trump life. Yeah, there's nothing about this guy. American, they have nothing to do with this. Let us see, Sky News English. Yeah, it looked like it. This is Sky News English. Man, the explosion is scary. Whew. Let me see. All right. Is the is the screen coming, guys, for you? In uh, Discord. All right. Let us see. I think now. Do you see how big the smoke? Sorry, guys. The one in YouTube, I can't show you because they might flag us for copyright. Uh, let us see. I'm just, I will show you fast, like hit and run. 
All right. Uh, here they are not showing anything yet. Yeah, this is the, this is the area where they hit. Look, look at the smoke. Whoa! What, what kind of bombs they use? Man, that is something. Yeah, and look at the chat. The chat is boiling. And a lot of Arabs celebrating his death. Those are the Muslim Sunni. See this guy here, he's calling him Zumera. Zumera nos lira. The lira in uh, Lebanese is the, the currency. They're saying Zum they, this is the nickname to insult him. They call him Zumera, nos lira, half, half pound, shawarma, and uh, missiles. Teet, teet. <laughs> All right, let's see the last update from the. Uh, from the Israeli news yeah look it's still the same that's hard to believe who wanna go in uh, who wanna go in his funeral man uh, you know, like, the Israeli are very nice, but if you ask me, in his funeral, all those terrorists will be there, right? If I am in charge, they should attack them. They are terrorists. They are not civilians. You know what I mean? They will be gathered by tens of thousands. You do not need to look for them. But I know what they will do. They will bring women and children to hide between them, so they, the Israeli will not attack. Yeah. <clears throat> Let us see if there is anything. Yeah, here they are still saying that uh, Hezbollah is avoiding to speak. Look, look at the small guys. What is this? What they did use? What kind of bomb? They used to hit Nasrallah. Man. What Iran will do will fart. They will not dare even to open, they will not dare to fart. You want to bet? Who want to bet? I thought you are part of the Mossad. What do you mean part of the Mossad? I called them, they received the plan. You see this plan? I am the one behind it. I told them where uh, Hassan Nasrallah he lived, all right? I told them he liked, uh, you know, certain food, camel urine. So I told them, look, because in Beirut there's not too much camels. Very easy, it's easy, you know? But the, the plan is really crazy. So I told them, look, where is camel live? Uh, Beirut is not a desert. It's not like Saudi Arabia. There's only a few camels. Beside him, you know. So uh, they chase uh, the camel, Tras, and they find only two camels in the whole city. Look at this, guys. Look at this. The whole building is gone. <whistles> mean. Nasrallah, do you hear me? You are hiding here, you potato, between women and children. They confirm that his daughter is killed. We don't know if this is, I hope not only, I mean, I hope it's him. So they are saying the Israeli news agency confirmed that the daughter of Nasrallah is being killed. That's not what we are looking for. We want him. Let us see any update here. Well, it's mean, obviously, he must be there in that, inside the house, right? I mean, if his daughter is there.
Let us see. Where is, where is? You know, this guy, uh, the foreign minister of Biden, he sounds like a fool. We have no idea the Israeli is doing this. Nobody told us. Who cares about you, potato? I mean, look at you. Look at this guy. This guy became a foreign minister. <laughs> he, he looked like uh, Zachary Naik when he was young. Uh, Joe Biden says U.S. was giving no period warning of Israeli strike in Beirut. Why do they want to give you a warning, potato? This is an independent country. Israeli military says Hezbollah's central headquarters in Beirut was embedded deep within civilians. Bingo. Now we are talking. We know that. That's not new. Is that new? Yeah, but until now they are not confirming anything really uh, all what I, I saw from the news that his daughter uh, according to the Israeli uh, 12 channel the daughter of Nasrallah is killed what about him we want to see Let us switch here. This is Sky News. Come on, Sky News. Yeah. We will not keep too much on the screen because you know they will be look 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 the whole building become i don't know how many floor the building oh this is the the interview of nasrallah i just saw what he was there look 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 there's a diver and this is the pager i mean are you serious you are going to find him now by digging this seriously a building i don't know how many floors six seven floors that's it, the guy is a potato now. If he is inside, he's inside, that's it. But how the Israeli knew who was inside to the point they knew that his daughter Zainab, his daughter Zainab was inside the house when he was, when they targeted the house. So here the news, they are saying that the daughter of... Uh, <coughs> of Hassan Nasrallah, which is not the target for the Israeli anyway, but you know, it is what it is. You see what happened when you have a VPN? You change your location. Anthony Blinken. All right, Israeli military says, well, last central quarter, okay, there's nothing new. Thank you, uh, Mr. Secretary. I want to ask the question again. Since October 7, you've been saying that Israel has, to def has the right to defend itself. And you've been stating all the time that they have the right to defend themselves against Hezbollah and Iranian forces Sound like an Arab. in the Middle East. So my question, you, now you repeat it, uh, how it does that matter? Can you clarify whether this Israeli approach to targeting Hezbollah's leadership falls un under self-defense, and what's the U.S. administration clear position on the policy on the policy? <laughs> Stupid. Anyway, <clears throat> uh, let us see what is the update in the Arabic TV stations. What they are saying. 
until now they are saying only they mentioned that the daughter of Nasrallah Zainab her name is Zainab Zainab Hassan Nasrallah is confirmed to be dead in the attack but until now we didn't see the confirmation but most likely the Israeli they did attack the correct location because obviously the family of Nasrallah all of them they are there all right ya hal hiya kafiya hadhihi al marakiz wa ila ay min al hulul sataljaun hinaha naam hala bi hadhihi al hal kaman all right so guys things look like it's very serious look like uh, nasrallah is going to be in heaven look this guy in arabic he's here he's saying happy for you nasrallah you know because he will be in heaven you know his penis will be endless now as Muhammad said this guy here is saying that when Ahmad Yassin Sheikh Ahmad Yassin became a murderer the Hamas the resistance they became way stronger uh, taking the just of gods all right uh, here is this guy saying Yemen Lebanon Gaza Iraq Syria Masr or we are one yeah right uh, this guy is saying we are going to have third world war this guy is saying Shalom Netanyahu from Iraq <laughs> that's a good one <laughs> Shalom Netanyahu from Iraq okay Shalom Shalom let me share that way, you know, with you guys in the Discord because I'm showing a different thing. I don't want you to be confused. All right, here we go. All right, let us read more comment. Uh, this guy says by Allah this is a revenge from Allah for what he did to the Syrian people the guy's name is Muhammad Amr those are Muslim Sunni the Hezbollah they killed a lot of Muslim Sunni in Syria a lot you know this guy he said whoever die from the group of the party of Satan's which mean Hezbollah it is for the sake of my shoe because it is a shoe Hassan uh, uh, he been smoke and my shoe is inside I don't know what kind of Arabic is there but this guy obviously is obsessed with the shoe you know like shoe 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 you know like uh, yeah this is what Hassan is actually wish wish shway shway wish wish uh, here this guy saying the people of jihad in uh, uh, they are uh, uh, like their their heart are burning and the most hard response will be against the Zionist all right this guy he said ha 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 they deserve it this is against Hassan Masala. Uh, this guy is trying to date a girl Hassan Nasrullah is dead and the guy is flirting with other guy I mean Arab you know Arab what you can say hey honey do you have a phone number like you know can, can you text me I mean the chat is boiling about death and the guy get killed and the guy like Durak Maror Kalbi Shinu Aadeh Ayuni Inta Ayuni Shinu Aadeh he wanna flirt you know like he's horny oh boy <laughs> Arab. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's see the the rest of the. Let's go go to the end. Look, look, look here. Surat bint min al Iraq. A picture of a of a girl from Iraq. She this is a girl. She is a whore. She's promoting herself. The guy is dead. Hassan Nasrallah and the Shia in Iraq. They are doing muta. A picture of a girl from Iraq. All right. The other one. 
a picture of uh, of a uh, of a uh, of a girl. What is this beauty, huh? You are so beautiful. His name is Hamudi. Look, look, look. I mean, this is like, this is the funeral of Hassan Nasrullah. You see what the Arab doing? They are so sad, man. The guy is 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 uh, is hitting drums. <laughs> Hassan is from hell. We will retaliate in the right time and the place. Ha 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 ha. They are laughing at him. Uh, I mean, the chat alone is fun. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I mean, this guy, Nasrallah, aren't you stupid? Don't you know? Okay, as long as they find everything about your leaders, obviously they knew your place. Uh, they are saying here in the news that Israeli, they look at this explosion, guys. Do you see how big this? What is this? And why the bomb is so brown? Is it a chocolate? Did they hit? Oh, Nasrallah was hidden in the chocolate manufacturer. Hmm. All right. Here they are saying, the Israeli, they said, they killed a big leader of the uh, leaders of Faylaq al-Quds, which is uh, the Iranian regime brigade, you know. All right, let us see the chat. Ah, uh, by the way, by the way, you see here, you see like this girl, she have a picture here. Mostly those are scammers. This girl, she's saying to the other guy, hello, hello, you know, she's looking for a girl, you know. It's like prostitution, you know. Yeah. Uh, Why the chat is not running? Hold on. The chat is not running. I just switch temporarily and let the chat run. Any update? Join community. Okay, nice to meet you. Uh, until now, there's no update here. Oh, hold on. Let me. <clears throat> what at the time now? Uh, we pass the time. But let me put in this radio station from Israel. To see if there is any news from their side. Because they always say the truth. They don't lie, you know. Not like Arabic station. Arabic station, they say things never happen. You can't trust what they say. All right. خاصة خلال الأسبوعين الماضيين كذلك أرسال نقلة طائرات أخرى إلى المنطقة. We will put it in the side. Maybe I will use the Bluetooth so it doesn't bother you to hear the news. Give me a minute. Uh, bubble, bubble, bubble. When I'm going to have my lunch. All of this is because of you guys. Let us see. Now we are using Bluetooth. So we don't bother you with the news from the phone. Yeah, let us see here. I see now they are announcing that the Israeli army, they are preparing to change the command for the people. Like this is for civilians. Uh, that's mean they are preparing for something big to happen. For sure. I mean, they will try to respond. And now they will use any weapon they have to revenge, you know. Yeah. That mean, that mean, Nasrullah is really dead. I mean, otherwise why they are considering that something big will happen as a response.
Yeah. <clears throat> Sky News, they are saying he's been targeted, but they are not confirming that he's dead. And now what they will do, I'm sure they will start attacking the American bases in Syria. So the American, they should be ready. You know, they will go crazy now. Yeah. It says here that the Israeli, they, 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 they inform the American, they inform Joe Biden that they will kill today an hour before the attack, they informed Joe Biden. The president of Iran, he announced that this is a crime against humanity. Potato. All right. Oh, boy. Yeah, you can use this browser, the one I'm using, the one is talking about the VPN. I don't know if you see here in the top, you can change your location, you can make it to China, you can make it any country you want, you know. You see it says VPN, it's active, it's for free. Actually there's a premium, you, know, you can use the premium, it's better, and you can use it for free. The one is asking about the VPN. Look at the comment here, look. Yeah. Yeah. Um See, <coughs> sorry, most of the comment they are making fun of Nasrallah. So most of the Arab really they are happy for his death. And those you see the heart and the missiles, those are supporting Nasrallah. The guy he repeat. What I just heard now from Israel that it's not only Nasrallah is inside that center. This is a headquarter of Hezbollah and many, many leaders were there. Not only him. It's like a big, big hit, really. Very big hit. What happened is really a disaster for Hezbollah. Look, look at this smoke, how big it is. Man, it's like it's like a volcano. Look at this smoke. You see the smoke? Wow. Look at this. Crazy. It's like a nuke, man. This is this is crazy. Look at this is smoke. Massive, massive, massive. It must be Hunter Biden or Joe Biden did the fart. Because, uh, you know, Joe Biden, his fart can do even more than this. Uh... Uh, soon the Israeli army will make an announcement 
it is C. Uh, no, no, hold on. Uh, let me see the. Let us see if the <clears throat> IDF, the IDF, they have any new announcement. Until now, there's nothing. Yeah, until now there's nothing. Look what this guy is saying. Thank you, Israel. 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 All of this. Thank you, Israel. This person here, wonderful, wonderful. What a what a happiness. Huh? Uh <clears throat> this guy sounds like he is from Morocco. So he said, uh, yeah, wonderful Fariha Jitliom, which means like uh, what a happiness came. Uh, uh, Nasrallah, he he fatas fatas in Arabic like when when somebody suffocate him from breathing. It's like you say it to insult, you know. Yeah, a lot of people actually they are uh, happy for that. Lavrov, the minister for minister of uh, uh, Putin, he says the Middle East is at the edge of uh, total war. Well, good. We know it's going to lose. Just try. Just try. Uh, in Israel, they announced that uh, there's a new update for for civilian how to treat the, like the, what's happening, which means there's something dangerous might happen soon. All right. Yeah. Actually, you know, I was wondering why until now they did not kill him. Because, you know, if they knew the place of everybody, I mean, obviously they knew his place. So I was saying to myself, maybe they are leaving him to negotiate with him, you know. Uh, I think from, from day one, they knew his location, but they don't want to kill him, uh, hoping that he can be useful, like in case, you know, to negotiate for uh, you know to withdraw but obviously he he, he don't want to listen so they decide to get rid of him all right they are announcing that this is the biggest bombs ever hit in beirut from the beginning of the uh, war uh, Israel announced that one of the bombs never been used before by the Israeli Air Force. It's a brand new. <laughs> uh, the Israeli army asking the people who live in the street and in the, in the territory of Al Laylaki in the the south of Beirut to evacuate immediately. Look like things will go crazy, guys. Man. Uh, the Israeli army asking the people who live in Safed and Jolan Haid and Galalia, like in Israel, to prepare and go immediately into shelters. 
Right. Obviously, this is this is uh, this is you know, is a real news. This is not somebody guessing. Right. <clears throat> I will update you with all the news I receive. Hey Nat, let me call Netanyahu again. He's busy, he's not answering the phone. I mean I know you know he used to be humble since he became a prime minister, he don't answer my phone call all the time. I don't know what to do with this guy. See how you like you 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 take your friends. Actually, once I did not answer a phone call from him <laughs> for real. <laughs> oh boy. Let us see. The Israeli, when they hit, they destroy six buildings in one hit. It is six buildings, all they are like a complex of Hezbollah, and they took them down all in one second, which means there's no way for anyone who escaped. And this is why I explain now why the daughter of Hassan Nasrullah is there. Look like it's a big complex for all leaders. I mean, look how stupid they are. They put all the leaders in in in, in like in one blocks, you know. Even the leaders of of uh, uh, the the uh, Quds Brigade of Iran was there too. He was killed. He was cooked. Hello. Hold on. Hello. Hey, who is the one who put somebody for me in the? No, no, no. I'm. Uh, I ask them. I'm from. Uh, I'm from Israel. Ah, uh, okay. You. you are from Israel. Oh, all I right. Live, I live. <laughs> I live in the Galilee. All right. What is the news? Go ahead. <laughs> uh, like uh, to be honest, like I was watching your previous live, and I got uh, I got the news like <laughs> I got I, like I got the news from you live. So. Uh, I mean, I know I know everything that you know, but for sure, uh, uh, yeah, there is like tensions, like uh, everyone like uh, waiting now. Guys, this this is why when you speak to a Mossad agent, he don't say anything. Look, look, he just said, "I know everything you know, and I, you know everything I know, and you don't you, you know what I know. So you know what we know. I mean, you are a Mossad agent. Tell me what's happening. I mean, what is, it? is that the news?" Guys, I know what you know, and you know what I know. And thank you very much, Habibi. Thank. You. Come on, tell them the news. What's happening? Uh, what you heard? Like, uh, Cor what Currently, you heard? the spokes, the your friend, the the, the spokesperson of uh, the IDF uh -huh. will soon uh, will soon speak. And yeah. uh, I think Nasrallah probably I think Nasrallah probably dead because uh, uh, Iran. Uh, I, I read in the Israeli news that uh, Iran says that everyone has replacement. That's me. That means right, that right. That, that means they are, that means it's true. Yeah, you are right. They will not say that. I saw that actually. Yeah, they they were, uh, when they say there's everybody have a replacement. That means he's dead. <laughs> so <laughs> Mossad Mo agent, do you want to send flowers, etc.? I have some connection, good connection in Lebanon. If you want to send the flowers, baklava, you know, to Hassan Nasrallah in his grave, falafel, just let me know. All right. Of course. All right. Sure. Sure. You pay only for shipping and handling. <laughs> yeah, I'm a, I actually I actually live uh, pretty close to the border with Lebanon. All right. Well, be careful and get ready because I'm sure now they will start shelling in your area. Huh? Yeah, to be to to be fair, it was pretty pretty quiet. Like uh, even the the few days, like uh, they only shoot at water. You know, they they hit the sea in Akko. In Accra, yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I mean, uh, they have firework, but you never know. I mean, now they will use anything they have, because this is will drive the the demon uh, crazy, you know. 
So uh, it, I, I think they don't. I, I don't think they. I, I think they, they have nothing. They, it's a paper. It's a, it's a paper tiger. I mean, if they had something, they would have uh, already already did it. <laughs> well, uh, still, you know, you, people they have to be careful because now is the time for them to use it if they have anything. So, like, just uh, have patient and be careful because this is the time they will show if they have anything. If they could not answer with anything, that means they have nothing, as you said. You have to be careful always, you know. Oh, right now they announce uh, uh, the Israeli uh, official, big, he said, which means a high, a high rank. Uh, the killing of Nasrallah is going to be totally different from any killing for any Hezbollah leaders. So it looked like it. The guy is cooked, but I will not be really uh, uh, happy to to hear. I mean, until we, the confirmation come to be for real, you know. Until now, they are saying, but we want we want some some something more like strong. Israeli. Uh, shalom, shalom. Shalom, shalom. Yeah, I'm I'm watching on News Twelve right now. They're saying. Um, Maskal Hezbollah, so the general of Hezbollah, Hassan uh -huh. Nasrallah, is has been killed. This is the presumption in Israel. This is the like the what people believe. This is the you know. All right. But it's likely. But, but if there's and, any official. No, no. So they're gonna say that soon. The spokesman of his of IDF is gonna speak. That's uh, Daniel Hagari. All right. And the Arabic spokesman said. Um, that everybody in Dahia needs to get out of there quickly. I'm thinking that if he is still alive, they're going to hit again. Yeah, well, I'm sure they will hit again. But I think I think they are going to hit uh, in a massive way. Uh, there is something bigger than this, something because they and they ask uh, like a couple of areas in uh, in Beirut to evacuate. So it's not going to be like. A, a local building is going to be a massive area so like you know a huge huge uh, attack will happen soon yeah that's possible there's been 65 launches into israel since the attack mainly in the north i, I live in the center in uh, yaffa yeah so... uh, i live in the western galilee uh, next to Accra, and it's pretty it's pretty quiet so far oh, yeah. at I least i saw alarms in carmio but yeah, people are very happy now. It's on the news. People are posting memes and stuff already. Shame on you. Why you are happy? This is the good man. Guys, do you see those Israeli? They are happy. Nasrallah is dead. Shame on you. You don't to be happy. Okay, as long as you are happy, join me. I, I will invite you for a lunch. <laughs> I, I, uh, once the spokesman speaks, I'll uh, come back. All, all right, all right. We are, we are now three happy. We need one more. We can play cards. Who want to join us? All right. Inshallah. Do, do you have uh, do you have black coffee, black Arab coffee? Oh yeah, I drink always. I, I I don't drink Arab coffee. I drink Greek coffee. There's nothing it's called Arab coffee. It's a lie. Since when the Arab have know. coffee? We, we I don't know. We in uh, in Akko in Akko we have uh, we have Arab selling Arab coffee. Well, uh, all of those names actually, <laughs> even even Greek coffee, even Turkish coffee is a lie because none of those countries produce coffee ever. This is something new for them. It's a it's a fake name. The coffee never came from those lands, so they are the last one to, to call a coffee by the name. But anyway, they say Arabica. I laugh. You know, everything is everything is upside down. Okay, it, uh, the agency of news in Iran saying that the leader of Faylaq al Qadis, the, the brigade of al Qadis, Ismail Qa'ani Salim, which is an Iranian guy, big big boss in Iran. Uh, uh, it doesn't say if he was killed or not. It says Salim, Salim. He is okay. He is not dead. Oh, okay. All right. So they deny that he was there and he was killed. All right. <clears throat> I have. Uh, I have my phone turned on i have a bluetooth in my ear uh listening to a radio station from israel at the same time i'm talking to you to see if there's any update news yeah yeah 
I'm I'm reading in Hebrew. If if I find something, I'll tell you. All right. All right. I'm receiving news now. Uh, you know, many they are saying that Iran will respond massively. I think, and I believe strongly, Iran will never dare. Iran is very weak, and the Israeli will smash them if they try to do so. You know, they will never dare. IDF update: Call in Lebanese civilian to remove away from several sites in uh, Hezbollah. Look like they will beat again in the same area. To confirm the death. Hmm. Uh, see here it says the the uh, uh, Iranian leader, supreme leader. He says every murdered uh, resistance leader will replace. So they confirm actually that he's dead. Oh, look at this here. You see? Wow, massive. Oh, I see. I see Iran saying that we are opened uh, the gates of hell. <laughs> Iran said we op uh, we opened. Ah, okay. Israel, Israel, like we in Israel opened uh, the gates of hell. They are right. We just opened it to send them there. <laughs> <laughs> we cannot deny that. I mean to that, you know. <laughs> you know, the Iranian, they were never there because the Israeli, they can destroy all or uh, refineries of oil. Which is the only source for money. Israeli can destroy it in two seconds, you know. We know that Israeli army how how uh, how far they can go. So they were not there. Let us see. IDF Army, we are proud of you. Thank you. Let me switch here. Okay. I just received a confirmation, but this is not me, as you know, I'm just carrying for you, a confirmation that Hassan Nasrallah is dead. All right. Looked like he was cooked for good. Well, I don't know what kind of bomb they use, but it's not normal. Uh, you know, uh, it says, like, uh, I don't know if you see the, but even the news says, Israeli themselves, they, they say, it, the bomb they use, they never used before. This is a bomb never, never been used before, you know, by the Israeli. Yeah. They told him, Nasrallah, behave. Potato. He don't listen. He think they are afraid of him, the coward. This is what I said. This Netanyahu, I don't like him, you know. He should do that long time ago. From the first day, they shot a rocket at Israel. Why you, why you make the civilian run away and leave their houses and their farms and their businesses, you know, for almost a year? They should have done this a long time ago. All 
Voilà. Et voici. Yeah, that's really talking about that Iran will respond, but I don't think they will dare really to do anything. Yeah, I think I am from Israel. You want to speak? Yeah, sure. Let us invite you. Hello. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? I hear you. Oh, good. How are you today? I'm fine. So you are from Israel? Yes, yes. I'm from the south, from Ashkelon and uh, Be'er Sheva. All right. What do you like to share with us? Go ahead. Um, it's my first time to, to talk to you. I'm very honored. You're welcome. I uh, follow you maybe after the 7th of October, and uh, I'm very happy what you're talking about and how you, and your vision and your perspective about the Middle East and the people that live in the country around uh, Israel. Well, I'm glad that people in Israel, they are listening to me, and I hope we will be able to make a difference so people will understand what the Israeli are doing and they have the right to defend themselves. Yes, of course, we we don't want uh, this war that uh, the leftists and the liberalism, liberalism uh, the Western liberalism, uh, in, excuse me, my, my English is not very well, of uh, uh, Israel government, uh, it's like, you know, give them all what they want and uh, give them to kill us and do whatever they want just to, to make our own uh, hurt. And yeah, this know, is yeah, this is why, this is why I don't like the way they do things in uh, the, the leaderships of uh, Israel, because simply it's you teach them how to behave. You know those those people they are savage, and if you don't attack them back, they will think you are scared. They will not say this guy he like peace. You know, they understand only one language, the language of war. So you don't you don't. Uh, you don't respond to them, they will think you are afraid, you are scared. As simple as that. Yes. Yeah. Uh, in my uh, time, uh, when I served the IDF, I served in uh, Hebron, in the West Bank, and uh, I see in front of my eyes and uh, how they behave, uh, and the atrocities, and the terror attacks on uh, Jews. It's, uh, you know, before maybe 10 years. I saw them. Yeah. And, uh, I know we can't uh, coexist without the terror. Get out. Uh, somebody in the chat saying, why Israel supported Azerbaijan terrorists? I will tell you why. For sure, I don't like that. Uh, for sure, I don't like that. But in case you do not know, the stupid Armenian government, they side with Iran against Israel. And actually, even the Armenian in Lebanon, they made another stupid mistake. They side with Hezbollah against Israel. So you side with their enemy, they will side with your enemy. As simple as that. You make a stupid mistake, and then you wonder why they support your enemy. Otherwise, for me, it's very sad to see what happened to Azerbaijan. I mean, to, to Armenia. The Turkish and the, Azerbe the Azerbaijan, they attack Armenia. So I advise the Armenian... You better know your friends next time and don't side with the devil because the devil will betray you. Here we go. They left you alone. Even Putin, he left you alone. You have the wrong friends. CP, I'm, yes. watching, Israeli, uh, I'm watching Israeli media and they're showing the pictures how people in Syria celebrating with baklawas and like everyone like dancing yes. in the street. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm sure. I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah. I'm sure, but those are the They're Muslim Sunni. That. Those are the Muslim Sunni, you know, because uh, uh, Nasrallah he killed a lot of their, you know, their people there. You know, 
Yeah. Yeah, no, no the, even the the Israeli media is amazed by <laughs> how much yes. the, the the Muslim Arabs are celebrating Nasrallah's death. Yeah, but doesn't mean they love you. By the way, don't like don't think they love you. They hate you the same. Oh no but, no no! I watch your I watch you long enough to know that. Yeah, so yeah. Me. So they uh, they they dance because they hate each other. But if you die too, they will dance for your death too. You know. They are evil. Oh, they, they definitely dance. They definitely dance in the 7th of October. I, yeah. I know it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Hamas, remember, Hamas is Muslim Sunni. The only difference is, is the is the side of the fight. Who is who? Who is against who? You know? Otherwise, it's same garbage. Let us see here what's happening here. The president of Iran said that the Zionist entity attacks on the southern suburbs are war crimes that cannot be hated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah. You. No, don't use bad language. The Zionist please. entity attack. Yeah. Iran stands by the axis of evil. Right, right. And the, not, not with the Lebanese people. All right. Here they are saying the, the, the Western forces in the north of in Iraq, they are an alarm. Yeah, for sure. All the American and everybody will be in alarm now because we expect the Iraqi. I am expecting that the Iraqi uh, terrorist they will shoot many drones at Israel. Uh, the daughter of Hassan Nasrallah, mm -hmm. night now is announced dead. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Inshallah. What inshallah? Inshallah, Habibi. Uh huh. Okay, let's see her name is what? What her name? Zainab Nasrallah. Let us show you how she looked like. Zainab Nasrallah. Like the shadow. She looked like a she looked like a criminal actually. You know. Let me show you. All those pictures is for the daughter of Nasrallah. Reports from Beirut, many flee Hold after on. the attack and the, the Israeli army speaker is speaking. Hmm. Israeli army speaker is speaking now. Yeah, I don't see him. Oh, here, here he is. Here he is. He did not confirm that Nasrallah is dead yet. He said, we will, we will update you when we know for sure. I'm listening to him right now, speaking in Hebrew. Yeah, so he is not confirming. He said, we will uh, we announce to you if there is any change in the inside Israel for preparation in a few hours in a few hours from now we are going to attack a strategic areas in Beirut strategic areas in Beirut will be destroyed good luck He's saying during the war in 2006, Hezbollah used to shoot from ships inside the, 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 the sea area. And even they explode a ship during that war. Right now, the now he's saying we prepare, we, we found what they are preparing for us. And now we will show how he is uh, hiding a strategic weapon under houses. Yeah, we will, you know, when the video is ready of the Israeli army uh, 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 posted, I will play it for you. 
I'm just listening from uh, from Israel directly, which is not in the in YouTube yet. All right. Anything you have from your side? Uh, not not really. Like, uh, is this is saying the the same thing? Like you know, like that we are ready in all the fronts. Yeah. yeah. That, uh, basically, what you what you said. Do you like a retranslation because he's speaking Hebrew? Yeah, hold on. So he said the uh, we we send the warning for all those people who live in a strategic area to leave immediately because and he mentioned the names, the building of peace, the building of Shadid, the building he named the buildings. All those buildings have to leave immediately. Through a very short time, we are going to attack those. But why he is telling them to leave? I mean, I don't know. I mean, if you want to. But I think maybe they are storing weapon down. Uh, so he's saying those buildings are going to be destroyed because they found that they have warehouses of weapon underneath of them. Hmm. So the Israeli are trying not to uh, like to, to kill uh, uh, people. They are trying to destroy the warehouses for weapon. He and he said an he will not allow he will not allow to transfer any weapon from uh, uh, any sea port in Lebanon. All right. Yeah, look like he's done. That's it. There's nothing more. Yeah. So look like the whole idea is uh, they uh, they decide to kill Nasrallah and they decide to clean everything. And now they knew all the areas where uh, the warehouses of uh, Nasrallah uh, weapon are located and they will clean it. But until now, there's no confirmation from the Israeli army, as I heard, that Nasrallah is dead. You know, let us hope that be, he is. To be exact, like uh, I saw it uh, very early in the reports, they uh -huh. said that if he was in the area, uh, there is no, there is no way he survived. If he, if he, the only yeah. way if he survived, if if he wasn't there. Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, but I don't think they will hit the area if they are not sure he is there. You know. Right. So I think By the reaction of Iran. I think they hit uh, they knew he is there there's you know there's because there's no sense to hit the place uh, let us see uh, by the reaction uh, by the reaction of uh, Iran he's probably dead well we have to wait we have to wait we don't know we will see but uh, the Israeli army, I mean, at the end of the day, they are official, so they cannot announce something unless they are very sure. And if the whole building collapses, I mean, you have to wait to see. We will know if he make a speech, you know, if he did not speak, that's it, he's dead, right? They can use AI. Um, eh, <laughs> eh, you know, I mean, it's, it's going to be obvious. It's not going to be the same. It's easy for for digital uh, technician to find out if it's true or not. Never, never will be real. Yeah. Uh, let us see. Uh, all right. Well, let us hope that good things will happen. Let us see here if there's any. New news. They are still doing the same. There's nothing much here. I don't see anything. <clears throat> you know, this is funny. This guy Blinken, the the, the American uh, foreign minister, is really mental. Thirteen minutes ago, uh, Blinken. He called both Israeli and Hezbollah to stop firing. That's what this guy is talking about. <laughs> I 
I mean, they what just... What a potato. Huh? What a potato. 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 So this guy is asking the Israeli and and, uh, and uh, Hezbollah to stop firing and, and things is, is going crazy. He, obviously, he's not even aware what is going on, you know, the mentally ill. Uh, he's on Mars. Yeah. Oh, this is uh, Netanyahu. Look, um, in a blistering UN speech, Netanyahu says Israel seek peace but will fight until victory. Good. Yeah, he made a, he made a speech today. He made a I speech. I don't believe it. Huh? I don't believe it. Well, we will see. I mean, they are doing a good job, so let us pray that they will. But do then, it. Harris, Harris will never uh, let us uh, really win like our people want. Well, Harris is not a president now, and they are weak now. It's election time, so you can make it. You have still you have forty two days, forty day, forty days. Only Trump can help us. Yeah. Uh, this is why we have to vote and uh, support Trump, you know, so he can win too. Trump 2024 fest. Run to vote. Yeah, we will see what we can say. Let us see here. This is his kind. I don't vote on Netanyahu. I don't. I don't like Netanyahu. I hate him. Well, it's the, too long. Yeah, he is the president. Uh, I mean, the prime minister for now. Look at this smoke. Whoa. Wow. Wow, that's crazy. The smoke is really something. They announced that this bomb never been used ever, ever before by the Israeli Air Force. Never. So I don't know what kind of what kind of bomb it is. I think it's made in Iran. <laughs> Never been used before. All right. Abu Ali Express. Yeah, Abu Ali this Express. Is the yeah. Let us see what will happen next. Let me check the update. All right. Until now, we don't see any confirmation. Uh, you know, this is was 10 hours ago. How come we did not even notice? I see here in Time for Israel, it says 10 hours ago, Hebrew media report growing Israeli assessment Nasrallah is killed in Beirut. So 10 hours ago, this has happened and nobody told me. Not even Netanyahu. Unbelievable. All right, yeah, 10 hours ago. This is not just uh, what looked like it did not, not go hot in the news until uh, very recently. Uh, let us see what's happening in the Arabic Arabic media. You know, to be honest, I, I, I saw in the media that there was like a an explosion in the Dachia, but I'm used to it already, you know, to hear like news about explosions. Yeah. So, so it wasn't, so it wasn't like something special. And only after your stream, like uh, live while listening to you, I like realize that eh, Nasrallah is there. <laughs> yeah. I was busy, you know, speaking to Abdul. I did not notice what's going on. And I wasn't expecting that to happen that far. I, I thought actually they will, they will save him. So, because if you want to negotiate later, it's better to have somebody who have a full control than somebody new. Maybe he will not be uh, totally obeyed. But we know that at the end of the day, those people, they obey Iran, not really Nasrallah. And because he's being stubborn, he, you know, he's so arrogant, I think they decide to uh, get rid of him. Yeah. The American, they announced they will do everything to defend their own soldiers and their own interest in the Middle East. Uh, yeah, until now there's nothing much yet. Let us see what else we have. Yeah. 
Why you don't call the Mossad phone number and let us put me on the air with them? I tell them CP when I talk to you. What do you think? No? Well, I can. I can. I can relay the message. Yeah, tell them uh, CP says again graduation. But can you confirm for us first? We don't want to buy baklava for okay, nothing. Okay. Obviously, you're a Mossad agent, you know. Yeah. You know, some certain people, certain people have a problem with you being a Zionist, yet uh, don't have problem with David Wood or an uh, apostate prophet being a Zionist. And yeah, you know, only only Zionist. me, exactly. You have a You see how covered they are. <laughs> you are right. By the, by the way, when I posted it, he deleted the comment for real. For sure, he would delete it. You know, are you kidding me? This guy delete everybody comment. But Tato, coward. Yeah, if you have a if you have a benefit with somebody, he don't want to cut the line, so he don't dare to you know accuse them of anything or criticize him. But he would do as soon they stop talking to him. You know, if they stop talking to him, they don't. There's no benefit to bring him people because he want to make money. If nobody do that, he will attack them. Just wait. It's just a matter of time. Yeah. I see on the telegram All right. that um, in the Dacia they they really they really are alert. They have what? Yeah, I I also I also read they blocked the road. They like put a lot of uh, roadblocks in Le in Lebanon. Yeah, I read it. Also, yeah, yeah, for yeah. sure, for sure they will. High alert. Yeah, for sure they will do for that. attacking yeah. from our air force. Yeah. Let me show you the, the picture of uh, the daughter of Nasrallah, the one they announced that she is dead. This is her. Very, very, very beauty. So they are saying... She looks that, like the knight. Her name is uh, Zainab. You know, the, the Shia are obsessed with Zainab. So they call her, her name is Zainab, and she is his direct daughter from some Muta. You know, this is her. Obviously, she was living in the same complex where the attack, uh, you know, the, the attack happened. All right. There is nothing yet, nothing new. They are repeating the same thing. I think they will keep saying the same thing for coming maybe three, four hours and until like maybe more because uh, if, if he is inside, the guy is totally buried. And as long as Hezbollah did not deny, that means it is true. You know what I mean? All right. Guys, it, uh, tonight we are going to make a funeral video and uh, we accept flowers. However, uh, Nasrallah now, he need a massage chair for $5,000. We have to put him in a massage chair so he can get back together. We, we need a glue, Tom. We need to border glue. So please, if you don't forget, mm -hmm. please, if you don't mind, you go to Samshun and donate five thousand dollars. He will buy the chair. He give it to Hassan Nasrallah, and then there is an angel will come from the ceiling, will confirm to him if Nasrallah receive it in hell or not. Hmm. Supporting the devil, you coward. Potato. All right. All right. It's a clickbait. Uh, look like you like the bait. Our friend here, I don't know what her name is saying. It's a click bait. If my page is uh, always full anyway, what bait? I do not need to make bait to make people come. I'm a Christian prince. What's wrong with you? Uh, I see uh, I see announcement that uh, the IDF said that they will not allow to transfer ammunition through Beirut airport. Yeah, I, I heard that before you. I heard that. I heard that directly from You're the me. from the uh, from the Israeli army official. You're quick. You yeah, he, he said he he said uh, uh, 
He said that we know that during the war in 2006, they were transforming uh, weapons using ships in the sea, and we were never allowed any uh, civilian port in Beirut to be used again for such a thing. All right. Where is the lady? Yeah, where is the lady? She said, I am making a click here. Hey, guys, do you like my click video? If you like my the click video, give me one. Click, click. Let us click. Give us like if you like the click. It's a clickbait video. Asrul Nasalla is not dead. I mean, all the news saying that. What the click? What's wrong with you? Did you eat hummus from the morning? What morning is the afternoon now? Oh boy. Yeah, don't forget to give us like, okay? If you like to give a flower to Hassan Nasrallah, give us like, give us like, you know? And uh, you let us, uh, you know, ask Allah to grant him all the virgins who Allah promised him in heaven and the endless penis who Prophet Muhammad, he promised him. I mean, imagine Nasrallah now in heaven right now and he have an endless penis. No oh boy. I feel sorry for you. What you can... How how they will put you in the coffin and you have endless penis? Imagine your penis coming out. Are we? The Israeli will cut it, hide it. Don't show it for now, at least until you arrive to heaven. All right. Let us see if there is any news. Until now, I see nothing. Clickbait, huh? You are jealous. Do you understand? Do you understand Hebrew? CP? Me? I understand any language in the world. Speak to me. Here we go. Any language you want. Do you know German? Uh, ah, see? Habibi. You know Habibi. Nah, nah, no, no, but we... Ah, no, 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 but, but I, I, speak, I speak with Arabs. Like, I don't speak with Arabic, but like, I have a, a Christian Arab friends and... Uh, so I, I know you need to you need to to give uh, to give the chet the chet you you need the uh, you need to you, yeah, you can't Hebrew, say like the, the Jews in Hebrew you don't have the uh, the the ach so you use the ech chet and ein yeah. chet chet and ein in uh -huh. ein yeah to sound to mm. sound uh, to, like you say it's a Hezbollah you don't you don't say Hezbollah Hezbollah right yeah yeah Hezbollah yeah yeah, yeah. see I know. <laughs> what do you know? You are learning from me. Come on. You see, goes those Israeli don't speak Israeli language. No, no, no. That's they are a, learning. That's a, mm. I learn. You know, you know. When I served the army, I was serving with a Maronite Christian, uh, oh. who his family, well, after the first Le Lebanese war, his yeah. family like uh, fled from yeah. Lebanon because from, uh, uh, from because they from helped Lahoud, us from Haddad army. Yeah, the Hud army. Yeah. yeah, yeah, the the South Lebanon army. Yeah, right, so right. Uh, like uh, his son. Actually, uh, like, uh, I've been informed. I've been informed that the radio of uh, this uh, militant in the South of Lebanon is being activated. Is that correct? The what? They, they have a radio station for the Houd army, being activated. The Lebanese uh, uh, South Army. Because this uh, this, this radio station been closed down since then, but now just uh, uh, I think a day ago, they uh, reactivated the Israeli IDF. They activated the radio station of those uh, Lebanese South Army, which support uh, Israel. Interesting. I didn't know that. Just, just you, know, you, know you know more than me. Sure, I know. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. You see, those are the those are the missiles. Uh, this is the guy is talking here. Let's see what he's talking. All right. Uh, I, th I think the, the video now maybe is already posted online. Let me check. So we can play it directly without this uh, stupid Arabic. No, it's still there's nothing there. So they are taking it from supply. I heard him already anyway. I translate what, what, he, what he said. Uh, yeah, so here they are showing where Hezbollah is. Uh, so this is the complex of Hezbollah. You see here, this is the complex. And this is where the target. 
and this is where they are asking people to leave to evacuate. So obviously they are storing a lot of weapon underneath of those uh, buildings, and they are asking. Or I mean, do you see how nice the, the Israeli? If this is an is the Islamic army or an Arab army, they will not care how many people there. They will they will shoot them right away, uh, because the target is to destroy, not to save people. But the Israeli, they send the warning in advance. Says, listen, civilians, leave. We are going to knock down those buildings. Nobody do that. And they say to you, the Israeli army is evil. All right. If they are evil, why do they care for the life of your citizen? All of those are there are Shia. They are members of Hezbollah, actually. Just because there's women and children, they say, leave. But if Hezbollah have the power of Israel, they will say to the Israeli, leave. We know what Hamas did. We know what uh, 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 Hezbollah doing. Hezbollah during the war in Lebanon, they, they kidnap a lot of civilians, slaughter a lot of civilians. The same in Syria. Yeah. Let us see if there's any. Oh, this is the building. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Became dust. Yeah, if he was inside, I mean, there's no way he can leave this building. How he can leave? I'm assuming he was like maybe two, three basement underneath of the building. Hope, like thinking that he can be safe in there. So this attack in the area is called Harat uh, Harik, in the corner of Al Alamiya. And this is where the building was located. All right. Daniel Hagar is still talking. Yeah, actually, there's nothing important here. I, I heard all the speech. Um, there's nothing much, you know, it's just a question of journalist. You know, actually, when they announce things in the news, like a speaker of uh, of uh, of the army, he doesn't say uh, things which is really can give any information to the enemy. So you have to be very careful in what he say. Uh, he he like he give only what he want the enemy to know, not what media want to know. You know, like the media for the army is just a way, either of deception, or uh let us say to, to influence like to if they want to scare uh, people who live in such an area they will tell them we are going to do this and this is going to go crazy run away so now people will go on uh, chaos and they will start running for their life so it can be fake it's just to scare them but we know that israeli in this case here they are not joking you know here it says the Israeli army announced that the, the, the hit was very, very precise. And we are collecting information about oh, what uh, happened to Nasrallah. So they are not confirming the death yet. They are confirming that the hit was very, very careful. And they are still collecting information. We will see. Let us hope that the information will become will come as positive. You know what's funny, CP? Yeah. They said they said Iran said that we crossed the line, and I mean, uh, they said I mean what line? Like I thought with the pagers we, we crossed the line. What line did, yes. did we cross this time? <laughs> Actually, I what I, what I learned that the Iranian uh, president already was killed by the Israeli army for he was with him. He had with him the same walkie-talkie explode, exploded in Beirut. So the, the, the Iranian president, he was killed by the Israeli Mossad. Good. In fact, no, it, uh, who, who, guys, who, who, remember, who remember the day he was killed, I am the only one who made a video saying he was killed by the Israeli Mossad. Actually, the name of the video, I think, 
It's called Israel killed the Iranian president. Anyone remember? Stop, stop, stop lying, CP. It was totally an accident. Yeah, and it wasn't, uh, it wasn't me. And uh, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> and the one who announced this actually right now is the one is the head of the security in the parliament of Iran. This is an official. He is the one who's saying that the one behind the death of the president, the ex-president of Iran, is the Israeli Mossad. And the, 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 he confirmed that he was using the same exact walkie-talkie which Hezbollah used in Beirut, which caused death of a lot of people. So why not? Yeah, I mean, this guy, he hates Israel. They replace him with someone is less aggressive against Israel. Smart. The one we have right now, he is a smarter. He don't want war. That's why Hezbollah now is so disappointed, actually, because they feel that Iran betrayed him. But this is a new president. He is trying to seek a solution. His country is collapsing. This economy is so bad. There is no even water in the in the in the in the Israeli in the sorry in, in Iran. They have a drought. So things is really bad. Very very bad. You know, it's not good. I see a big hole here. Until now, the fire, imagine, guys, until now, the fire is going there. Oh, boy. Let us see here. Yeah, I just found another video here. Let us see. This is from X. It's like an earthquake. I wonder what kind of weapon they did use. It's not even the fart of Allah is that big. Guys, don't use those. Uh, show respect. What's wrong with you? Those guys, they are using those uh, stickers, you know. Show respect. Uh, that that was a big pager. Definitely yeah. a big pager. We should be uh, crying, upset. You know, like send him, send Nasrallah. I miss you. You know. We miss him already. What's wrong with you? Show respect. I see. If there's any more. This is posted by who? Lebanon trend. Ah, the Lebanese are trending. It says the Israeli army, they announced that they use a bomb, only 2,000 tons. That's it. Yeah, not a big deal. <laughs> you know, this is me before I fought. Uh, okay. 2,000 ton. Oh, boy. Only? Seriously, you wasted all these uh, things for uh, Nasrallah. What about you send one ton? That's a lot. Let us see if they have any more. I don't see anything here. What is this? We were at war. Now we have Billy dancers and women dancing. This is Lebanon Trump now. The beauty queen of Lebanon. Here we go. I mean, those guys didn't have war. Lebanon, by the way, is two two different galaxies. The Muslims area is Allahu Akbar. You go to the other side, you see this. Oh boy! <laughs> this is Lebanon too. <laughs> this is Lebanon too. You believe it? This is Lebanon. The same Lebanon. Yeah, nice to meet you. This is Lebanese lady. Uh -huh. All right. This is Lebanon too. Before uh, Nasrallah? Before huh? Iran? After Iran? Before Iran or no, after No, no, this is uh, this is uh, this is older, older. But I'm saying this is the same country. They say to you the country is bankrupt, etc. Uh, but obviously there there is people who they are very poor. There's a lot of people who they are, they don't know what to do with money. I, I click just to see if they have more news about uh, Nasrallah, but uh, 
I mean, what I see here, I see nothing. Uh, reply, media, post, pinned. I have to log in to try to see more. Okay, forget. We 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 Nasrallah Nasrallah we 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 where are you where are you? Look how many we we is coming. A special reward if you can find any finger of Nasrallah. It says like in like in Qasim Suleimani. Yeah, Kasim Suleiman. The ring is the yeah, yeah. indication. Yeah. It's our. It's so not you see, Trump. Trump you see this area. This this area is five hundred meter. Uh, look, look here next to it. Look at this. Next to it, there is a there is a a, a Christian monastery minister, there. So they they put the weapon, and Nasrallah is next to the Christian ministry of uh, of Catholic nuns to hide him. Because the Israeli will not harm and and, and uh, you know uh, uh, shoot such a building, so he is hiding next. Guys, look at this. He is hiding just next to the Christian uh, Catholic nuns building as as a as a as a protection. He is using the Christians, you know, but the Israeli are smarter than him. Uh, they were able. To destroy the building without harming uh, 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 where the Christians are located. All right, another another video. The Christians in Lebanon is our our hope. Yeah, but you know the Israeli they have to help them, they have to arm them, in order to get rid of this garbage. And they not I should think, not uh, should not repeat need, the same uh, mistake before. I this think is, I think French. I think French and the new in the US and the European Union give them the the guns and all what they need. No, no, no. They they are far. You know, you need somebody in the border. Uh, this is look, look, look how yes, big. we can. Look how big. We we can together make control, but we can give all uh, you know <clears throat> the materials. Yeah, look how big the the space is destroyed. You see how 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 massive the area. Massive. I mean, the whole the, the I don't know what kind of bomb this bomb is. Only the area they want to destroy is destroyed. The rest is still there. The building around is not even damaged. I think it's a bunker buster cocktails cocktail bomb with a new bombs yeah. that we don't uh, never use. Let us see here. This is never used in a weapon. I yeah, I, I heard they are saying there is never been used. Oh, listen, 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 listen. The, the Israeli media said that uh, the fact that Netanyahu went to the UN was a trick on Hezbollah because they assumed that we will, we will, not, uh, we will not do something like that. Uh, while, uh, uh, like a, uh, when mean, Asral... during the speech, you mean? <laughs> yes, it happened during the speech of uh, Netanyahu. Ah, so the Netanyahu was talking, <laughs> uh, maybe maybe to, to bring him to the t to the TV room. <laughs> yes, yes, maybe. <laughs> wow, such a potato heads! I don't believe it. If it they if eat it's it. true, if it's true. <laughs> wow, guys, do you hear the Israeli? Uh, do you do you hear the Israeli uh, accent, English accent? It's funny. <laughs> Not only me, you yeah, you laugh at me. Funny. You see, you laugh at me. All of us Middle Eastern, our our accent is very funny in English. You know, speak, speak more. <laughs> no, no, I, uh, yeah, you know, my my mother, my mother, she's uh, she's Russian. So I like when I speak in uh, when I speak in English. Funnily enough, like my Russian accent is back. Oh, okay, all right. <laughs> But you are speaking exactly like all Israelis. It doesn't matter, actually. You speak like the all Israelis. Ah, really? Yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah. I feel his accent. I can feel his accent. I am half Ukrainian, so I feel it, the accent. Yeah. But do you see how big this? This is a huge. This is really huge. Let me see. This is Al Mayadin. Yes. This woman is copying from Al Mayadin. Al Mayadin is. It's not enough, but. 
Hold on, let me see if I can find okay. Al Mayadeen. Al Mayadeen is a, is a TV station in Lebanon. Support support Hezbollah. They are they are Hezbollah station. This guy he used to, the owner, he used to work for a Jazeera terrorist, and then after that he opened his own TV station. All right, it says that the one who died uh, in this attack, only six. Very hard to believe. There's no way. Six people, all those buildings have only six people in them. I mean, they love to lie. It's like Sam Shamoon, he have only 10 comments in a video of 15,000. <laughs> right? I mean, who in the world want to believe that only six people, it says in the Mayadeen station, Hezbollah favorite station, only six people died. How this massive land, all those buildings are full of people, only six people die. I mean, do you know even how to lie? Learn from Prophet Muhammad. Yeah, six people only die. Yeah, six people. Oh, look, it says here from sources, this is confirmed sources from Hezbollah, that they lost any communication with Hassan Nasrallah. Things is getting serious now. This is Reuters confirming from Hezbollah that they lost any communication with Hassan Nasrallah. The guy is already is gone. So things is getting more serious. 72 goat virgins yeah look like uh, because they are saying this is from Nasrallah from Hezbollah sources not Israeli uh, you know usually they announce those things to prepare themselves for what is coming as a news you know what I mean that's mean Hezbollah want to announce that he is killed somebody saying Israeli is hitting uh, Beirut airport Really? I don't know. I don't see that. Let me see. I'm, I'm, I'm trying. I'm uh, starting to suspect that you're really a Mossad agent, CP, because uh, I don't get this news. You don't get the news because Shaitan he pee in your ears. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh... All right, let us see, let us see. Yeah, until now, I don't see really any confirm, but I see here, it says that Reuters confirm that from source from Hezbollah, that they lost commun any communication with Hassan Nasrallah, the leader of Hezbollah. So things obviously is getting very serious. This is the potato, the prime minister of Lebanon. He's just come back useless. He's a toy in the hand of Hezbollah. He's a Muslim Sunni, but they use him and they abuse him. He's saying that the attack of Israel on the south of Beirut is a crime. Potato. Crime, huh? Killing terrorists is a crime. All right, all right. Look, uh, look how many people they are happy. You know what's funny? like uh, after after we started to attack lebanon like before it about uh, 11 months no one cared when uh, hezbollah was shooting at us was yeah. shooting rocket at us no one no one cared and the moment when we activated the pagers and yeah. later started started to bomb to bomb them seriously then suddenly we need peace Suddenly we need ceasefire. Suddenly we need to stop the escalation. Yeah, yeah, exactly. This, and it's... <laughs> this is why, this is why I, I told people, this guy, Netanyahu, he should do that from the beginning. I was upset, really. He should attack first uh, the borders, which is uh, with, with Egypt, to cut the supply. This is the first thing I would do if I was in that charge. And those uh, Hezbollah, I will immediately after they shot, the, because they test you, you know, they test you. They shoot one bullet. If you don't respond, they shoot two. If you don't respond, they shoot five. Because now they knew 
And and the media they keep saying they don't want to go on war. They don't go. On. So now you are encouraging them by by saying that. So if he is a smart, he should do right away what he what you did what you did now in in less than three days. You know, finish it, and the Israeli will go home. All the, almost eleven no, months. They have they have a very good propaganda. I gotta say it like uh, like I was believing that a war with Hezbollah is going to be like. Uh, uh, you know, like a thousand missiles a day or, or something like that. And, and as I said, like I live in a Galilee, I live like 10 kilometers from uh, from Lebanon. Like I'm, I'm about, uh, like if you look at the map, I'm about where where, where uh, Akko is, Accra, you know, I think, inside the city. Yeah, I, I think and, what happened. And, and it's quiet. Yeah, I think what happened, the Israeli army intelligence, they were in a sleep for a good time. So when the war happened, they are not ready. They don't have too much intelligence to attack. So they waited all this time until they were able to implant all those plans and spy and get the information. And then it, it took them time because simply somebody was not doing his job. Right? Yeah, here it says that the, uh, the people of uh, uh, the Shia in the south of Beirut, this is Shia territory, they are moving by thousands from that area after the Israeli alarm. As I said, usually uh, you can you know, create like a chaos in the, in the area by announcing such a thing. But I think the Israeli, they mean it. You know, they will, they will bomb it. Yeah. Uh, Yeah, you see, he don't live there. They are saying that Nasrallah was visiting that place. I think he was visiting his daughter. Now I know, because it doesn't make sense. His daughter, she is married, so why she is in the same house? It doesn't make sense. So I think he was visiting his daughter, and they were tracing him, and they hit that building. Now we know, most likely, this is what happened. Yeah, I don't know if you saw the report, but it says that they are attacking right now in uh, Beirut. I'm not sure. Yes, the attack is uh, starting right now. They are attacking where? Which area? I'm not. I'm not sure if it's Beirut. Wait, like I, I have, I have bad connection here. No, they are. They are attacking in the Shuf. The Shuf is the mountains where the Druze is. The Shuf. It says 400 people are, uh, um, how do you say it, like trapped uh, beneath the, the ruins. Yeah, but you see in the Al Mayadin, they say only six people get killed. <laughs> I mean, look at this, man. Uh, I, 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 read, I read like from the latest, like... Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, but Isra no, I'm, I'm, saying, I'm saying, look how they lie. It says, you just said 400 people are trapped. But I don't think they are trapped. I mean, they are going to be dead if they are in the building. No, it says Dahia. It says Dahia. Ah, in the Dahia, not in the building. Not in the building. Okay, okay. No, Dahia have tens of thousands of people. It's not. Uh... Uh, they said they're attacking. They're attacking Hezbollah weapon depots in uh, inside. Yeah. The so this is the right area. Now. Yeah, this is the area where they told people to leave. They are attacking again. They already told them which area to leave it from and look like they are attacking again. We will see. Here, this is Sky News. There is nothing serious here. Always those news are useless. Let us see here if there's any update. I see some update uh, that the Dachia is shaking. Yeah, it's as yeah. I said, like I said. You see, it says PM, Prime Minister trip to New York, part of the vision, uh, the version. So Nasrallah would think he is safe. Wow, that's, you see? So his trip to, yeah, thank you for going to, uh, you know, you should go to New York every day, man. <laughs> yeah, they are saying that this is what happened, you know? Yeah. That is something. I don't know why this. Uh, why my screen is doing that? 
I'm not sure. I'm trying, hold on, I think I did something by mistake. All right. I'm trying to fix the the size of the screen. I don't know why it's doing that in my area, in my side here. I'm not sure what is the reason for this. Let us see if we put the TV. Ah, if we put the video, it fixed that. If we put the strange. All right. Ali Larihani, the counselor, special counselor of the leader of Supreme in Iran. Anyone die from the leaders is easy to replace, no problem. Announcement from uh, Channel 12 in Beirut, in, the, in, the, in Israel, that Israel is preparing to go to wide war. A news from Channel 12 confirm, based in analyze, that Nasrallah is dead. Yoo -hoo! Uh, Channel 12 is a potato. I wouldn't really? trust them too much. Okay, it's the guys. hippies, Channel 12. Channel 12 is the potato, so I take back what I said. <laughs> it's the leftist. It's yeah, the leftist, but... heavy leftist, like, like very light. They, they to are manipulate the, people, our heads. It's they, the CNN. Not, they are hippies. The yes. They like are the CNN, hippies. CNN, CBC, Al Jazeera. People call them Al Jazeera. Really? Just, yeah, but what, if, if, no, they, no, no. If, they, if they are lifty, why they are confirming the death of the guy? They should, uh, you know, I don't know. We will see. Because it's general. Hmm. Because it's general. People need to know. Yeah. Not because uh, taking side uh, left it, right. for the same reason Al Jazeera reporting it. <laughs> yes. Maybe. Yeah, maybe they are copying from Al Jazeera. Yeah, I don't know. They are copying from Al Jazeera. They have uh, close friends, I think. Let us see what's going on here. I'm trying to call Netanyahu, but he's not answering. I mean. I don't know. I, 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 I don't know what's wrong with this guy. That's it. I will never put him in the in the in the job anymore. You know, I mean that's it. I made you a prime minister, and then you stop taking my call when I'm live on air to see what happened to Nasrallah, my friend. We used to be together, Nasrallah. We eat. Uh, I I drink. I eat ice cream. He drink camel urine. You know. What's wrong with you? Yeah, this is Sky News. They are Sky. There's nothing here. Sky News is dead. And here there's nothing else. Nothing new. Okay, six minutes ago. After evacuation, uh, cause IDF strike building house in Hezbollah. You see, the one they announced they would strike it just a few minutes ago, like maybe 10 minutes ago, you remember? They did attack it. So they gave people like 10 minutes to leave right away. And they attack it. So this is a new six minutes ago. All right.
uh, the Israeli army announced that they will stop any uh, try from Iran to uh, to deliver uh, weapon and arms to Hezbollah through the sea. Those are cars. Do you see, guys, the cars? Those are Hezbollah people. They are leaving the, the, the Hezbollah territory by thousands. I thought we were supposed to be the cowards. I mean, yeah, that's what I hear. according to them, the Jews are the cowards. According to them, the Jews are the cowards. And again, yeah. I'm 10 kilometers from Lebanon. I mean, yeah. close. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I don't know if they will do a ground invasion you know I don't know we will see but uh, if they do ground in invasion that will be fun you know Hezbollah will be fleeing actually I believe that all those attacks they destroy the spirit of any fighter anywhere in the world like doesn't matter what you believe in really when you see this is happening to you, the, this is very, very, very important to destroy the spirit of an army. So those now Hezbollah fighters will be really very, very low in the spirit because they, they are really under the shoes of, of Israeli army. They don't know. They don't know what to do. Uh, This guy, he looked like he did not sleep for a century. He must be watching my program. <laughs> not this guy, the other guy. I think the ground invasion to Lebanon, it's happened 100%. Only because the commando division uh, is right now in the north. And it's not a division you can mess with. And, uh, you know, it's uh, also, uh, also like... Uh, this more this morning actually i saw like a video from uh, the idf uh, spokesperson like he's showing you know like before the war in gaza like before the ground invasion in gaza yeah they they showed uh, they showed like a video how they transfer uh, transferring like a, a lot of tanks from uh, from north to south and uh, and now they're doing the opposite and by the way they look brand new so i mean uh, I see. I see a lot of Abdul say that they destroy like I don't know, like five thousand Israeli tanks in uh, in Gaza. I, mean, I see I mean, it like everywhere. Actually, up. I can I show up, you yeah, even yeah. the missiles of Hezbollah. They were empty. I saw Israeli taking pictures with it. It's empty. It's, there's nothing inside. It's a tank, empty tank. So we know this is false. You know, who cares what they say? So yeah. I, so I said I saw a video that show like a lot of like um, mechanical. Uh, vehicles like uh, you know like uh, tanks like uh, military vehicles like tanks like uh, uh, tra uh, tr tractors like d9 and stuff like this like moving them uh, to the to the border with lebanon so I, i'm not sure I, I don't know maybe it's uh, maybe it's a show you know to make okay. them to make them afraid maybe but, so uh, you yeah, know they, war they definitely released it war is about deception let us see we got a new video here let us see this is for the new attack i guess this is the second one. This is the one they announced they will do, and they ask people to leave. You see it? This is the one they announced they will do. I'm not sure why my screen, when I do this, the video becomes small. I'm not sure really. Okay, let's try to. Maybe if we size it like that. Still... Oh boy. Even even you getting your news from Abu Ali Express? No, there's you know, somebody you know he was a... No, somebody posted in the in this one posted in Discord, so I click at the link. You know, he was he was like a, probably a real Mossad agent. Uh -huh. The guy who who like posting this. Like uh, they interviewed him in a in Israeli media and he was like uh, you know like 
not not showing his face and uh, he said that he he was in the intelligence uh, yeah i don't know i never actually heard of this about ali express i know him ali the, Oh my uh, you can, uh, like uh, I, rec I recommend you to follow him in, in uh, for example like telegram like he's uh, he's posting stuff like most yeah of, most of I, I don't the I don't have really I don't have uh, this is uh, this is X this is not about it this is it says here Raylan given givens this is not about it it says here Jewish no, warrior. But, uh, but water, water. There is like a water marker in uh, in Hebrew. Ah, uh, 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 okay. So he, uh, I see. So it's coming from him for sure. You mean? Okay, all right. I see. Yeah, I see many posts actually. Yeah, look at this one. This look at this attack here. This is the second. I see on the Telegram that the dozens of UFOs plants use. 85 tons of explosives. Wow. Yeah, look at this. Let us put the sound. Let us put the sound. The, the image is not so clear, but I yeah. guess it's night time. A lot of firework. Takbir! Allah Akbar. Take a beer. Cheese kebab, hummus. Yeah. yeah, all right, all right, that's enough. Hummus, shawarma, falafel. Falafel. <laughs> you love shawarma and falafel? Yeah, yeah, yeah heard, I, I miss that. eating falafel. All right, look, it says here that the Iranian uh, uh, regime, they prepare to make a very, very, very important announcement. Let us see what will happen. They will announce that Hassan Nasrallah, he is right now in heaven, an Israeli, you know what? We are going to attack you, but not now. Later, later, maybe <laughs> next, uh, you know, like, uh, yeah, like the same what they did with the Haniyya. The response is coming and still is coming. Yeah. It's coming. There is a there is an Abdul in the chat in uh, in Discord saying uh, he tagged you and said, uh, uh, "CP, you are you are a Lebanese. How can you betray your country?" How he knew where I'm from? If if I'm Lebanese, how, how I betray my uh, country? Those are the enemy of of, uh, of Lebanon. <laughs> you stupid idiot. Those are the enemy of Lebanon. Any 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 person who love his country. He will not welcome. Even the Muslim Sunni are making fun. Look, read the text. Read the text. Those are Muslim Sunni. Look, they are making fun, saying we will, we will, we will give uh, baklava. We will give etc. You know, those are your Sunni. Laughing at it. Read. You know, this is your people. Look, do you see the people laughing? Look, this guy says Zumira. He become a joke. They call even Nasrallah, they call him Zumira, which means uh, like, uh, you know, those uh, for kids, you know, like they have a, they have a, like a pipe when you blow in it, it open. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about. Like when you blow in it, there is like a, a kind of paper, like go, go to the front, but very fine noise. So look, all of them, they are dancing. Do you see people with, with the laughing faces? Uh, yeah, those are the, those are Muslims, Sunni. Huh? And look, look how filthy. I mean, look, this guy is saying to the Muslim girl, can you let me do it with you? Which means, boom, boom. Those are the Arab. Look at this. Huh? I am 19. How old are you? Nasrullah is dead. And look what they are doing. Petito. You know? <laughs> this guy is saying to Zuzu, hey, Zuzu, how are you doing? Huh? Zuzu, Hello? Is, is that a place for, like, I mean, the guy is dead in the news and the war is happening and the Arab are seeking sex. Hmm. <laughs> so few on saying, oh, you're light. I want to flirt with you. Hala, hala. Welcome, welcome. Yeah. This guy is saying, his name is Hazim. Any women from Idlib and she live in Idlib? 
<laughs> Muslims. <laughs> well, what's their chat? You will know why. Uh, uh, I mean, uh, if you are a Muslim who speak Arabic, tell everybody, am I lying? You can use Google. Actually, you can use the phone. Listen, listen. you can freeze the comment or take a screenshot and you can use Google Translation to translate. Do it. It's all about sex. Listen, Nasrullah is dead and you are doing this, Muslims? Haram! All right. Uh, look at the people running. People are running for their life. Look, 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 look. You see the cars? All those cars. And they say to you that uh, Beirut is bankrupt. Where does people get in all the cars, find nice cars and gas and you know? Anyway, so he is saying that the Israeli army, those news is old. I mean, he's saying they will attack those places. They attacked them already. Potatoes. All right, all right. I want to keep busy with something more important. Hold on. In this occasion, what we can use? I don't know. Maybe this one? Do you guys, you know... Uh, you see, guys, today, by the way, all those people here didn't know how to use those emojis, but by my own special intelligence, I taught them all. All right? Sahir Bukhari, hadith number uh, zero, uh, two zero uh, emojo. Didn't know how to use it. Yeah, they have witnesses. Guys, who want to witness with me? If you want to witness with me, give me one in Discord. See, everybody give me one, nobody. Anyway, come on, guys, give me one. Come on. See, see here we go. Ah, I got you busted. You are lost. Okay. Uh, the Israeli army attacking the warehouses of uh, a weapon for Hezbollah in the south of Beirut. All right. <clears throat> one minute ago yeah this is an old news I heard I, I, I saw the Lavrov he says the Middle East is going to go a massive war shut up potato stop attacking Ukraine you idiot you help the Iranian and you attack the Christian coward potato Look, look at the explosion. Those are the new ones. This is the new ones. You see the explosion? Those are the new explosions. I know this picture looks like frozen in the TV station. It's not from my side. Maybe they are using a camera made in Iran. They don't even know how to make a camera. What camera? Yeah, maybe, but it's uh, very, uh, you know, oh, what, what, what is that? Where you go? Commercial. The benefit of using VPN. Biden, he command that all American embassies in the area should be very careful. Yeah, they will attack, you know, they will try to seek revenge. Cowards. This is Beirut. Ya Habibitna Beirut, Shu Sayer Bedini. Beirut, ya Beirut, Dakhlik Latin Haini. Such a beautiful place. Beautiful what? City? 
no, your voice, your voice, beautiful. Ah, oh, my voice. I, I, this is, I get it from Allah. Yeah. <clears throat> from, uh, from reciting, from reciting the Quran. Yeah, exactly. No, this is a song. Uh, it is, it's like a sad song about uh, Lebanon. I mean, those people they destroyed. You know, Beirut used to be. Uh, uh, I mean, a thousand times better than France or Paris or, you know, all those areas. But since those terrorists, they, 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 they came to this land, they destroy everything. The uh, a Lebanese person, not long time ago, uh, if you have a Mercedes, that means he's poor. If you buy, if you buy for your son, uh, uh, like a, a jeep, he's getting upset. I mean, dude, what you know? You, 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 I mean, BMW everywhere. Everybody fancy cars. Uh, life is so so good. And look what happened. Look what they did. Yeah, the Iranian came, the Sunni came, the Muslim came, and the madness come with it. Uh, <clears throat> People, they are making comments, they like my voice. Guys, should I uh, ch change the, what I do on here? <laughs> in fact, you know, all those singers who sing, this is not their voice. Do you know what they're doing? They, they have those equalizer. Like for me, I have a normal microphone. But those singers, they have equalizers. It filter their voices. If you hear them with normal uh, microphone, you will see how their voice is less than normal. It is always a software. With auto tune. It's oh. called auto tune. Yeah, a dish is a, okay. Yeah, there's nothing new. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what they call it, but uh, because I I remember once there's a very famous uh, singer in the Middle East. Uh, uh, actually, he's Lebanese. His name Raghib Alama. Uh, I heard him like in person. His voice is totally different. From his voice in you know in the cds i mean there's nothing there's no connection between them yeah until now they are saying nothing let us go back to israeli news anything any update after evacuation call at a strike okay 15 minutes ago refresh Three minutes ago, Biden ordered U.S. forces in the Middle East to do to be adjust as necessary. I like that. Uh, Lebanon Health Ministry rises death and total strike to Surah six. I mean, who in the world want to believe this? Six people died only in such an attack. Why? I mean, all this a huge, massive area, six people in it. This is Beirut, my friend. Uh, Ah, see this housing here, the one they attack, it's a housing for uh, ships. Uh, sorry, uh, uh, like anti-ship missiles. So it looked like what the Israeli doing. They are cleaning the warehouses of Hezbollah from all those weapons so they can get a closer most likely from uh, the seaport. Maybe they are going to put, uh, let us say, uh, a fence around the seaports. That's why ah now I know, because he said we will not allow the 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 Hezbollah to use any Lebanese seaport as a place to import weapon. So this is why they destroy those uh, places because they have anti ship missiles, so they can get closer. I see, and this is pictures of the explosion. Uh, CP. Yeah. Uh, Ynet News. So Israeli news are just saying now that a person close to Hezbollah or so, uh, someone who's close to Hezbollah says that the communication with Hezbollah has been cut off and with the majority of the the leader leaders of the. I uh, said uh, I said that 20 minutes ago. You are late. Yeah, I'm late. I'm sorry. <laughs> Guys, those are the um, one in Israel. They don't know what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> I was in the toilet. I came back. I see this. Ah, you see? Nazrullah is gone. He have a diary. All right. Okay. <laughs> I don't blame you. I don't blame you. That is a shitty news for them, but it's good news for you. All right. All right. 
Yeah, actually, I did not sing for long, actually, but I'm happy, really. Yeah, because this is, you know, remind me what they did to the to Lebanon, you know. That's why I was singing this song, Habibitna uh, Beirut. Shu sayir biddini Beirut ya Beirut Dakhlik la tinhini Ya Habibitna Beirut Shu sayir biddini Beirut ya Beirut Nasrallah bil bili Inti al hub al hani yeah, Nasrallah bil Billy, which means he went to Jahannam, to hell. All right. <clears throat> Let us see. Until now, I didn't see too many, too much news. Let me see when you hear if we can get anything. Give me a minute. Guys, I'm really angry. Somebody make me a sandwich. How many hours I'm online now? All right, let's see what's going on here. <coughs> All right. I will see if there's something good. Let us hope we will hear a good news soon. Nothing. La la la. Just like the old days? What happened in the old days? What those guys are talking about? What all this? I'm talking my back. Uh. Yeah, the news that I see now in Hebrew says that uh, the IDF will will ask will attack uh, Beirut more frequently. Oh, for sure, things because, now. Uh, yeah, it looked like they make a decision to go to whatever it's going to take, you know? Yeah. Uh, it says here, yeah, a continue the, round of attack on in, in, in the south of Beirut. Yeah, they say challenging, they say like in Hebrew, they say challenging days are ahead. You see, look, this Muslim, uh, he is praising Hitler. Do you see him in this court? He is praising oh, yeah. Hitler. Yeah, the guy, his name Kalash, the one who was talking to me yesterday, remember? He is praising Hitler. Does he, Abdul? What, the, yeah, does Abdul. he know what Hitler says? Does he know what Hitler says about Arabs? Or uh, or he's an idiot? Well, he don't care. He's a Muslim. Yeah, he don't care. Uh, here it says more, more continue attack. Look, 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 look. This, this is the new buildings being attacked right now. Yeah, this is old picture, but the, the one before it, it was from the old, uh, from the new, new images. We will go. Uh, the funny is, in, in the Sky News, there's nothing really. I mean, the, the, the Western media is empty. There's nothing there. This is a guy who is recording from far distance the explosions. He's hiding between the bushes. He's a scared. I mean, people are weird. What what the point of such a video? There's nothing there. Why are you even showing it? Hey, Nasrallah, how are you doing? <laughs> a nice smile, buddy. All right, all right. Okay, okay. Yeah, good for you. You are in heaven of Allah now. That's it. You are going to enjoy the versions. I see here, all of those actually, a lot of comment, all, all is happy. Including even Iranian, you know, I, I see Iranian are happy for the death of Nasrallah. Even Iranian, can you believe it? Yeah, 
That's that's what about it says. The, about Iranian, about Iranian, I'm I'm not surprised to be honest because I know a lot of people in Iran uh, absolutely hate. Yeah, yeah, Islam yeah. and uh, yeah, a lot of them uh, they are con converting to Christianity too. It says here seven, uh, uh, seven uh, uh, like uh, uh, air strikes done by Israel in the last hour, only, only in the south of Beirut. Seven, that's a lot. And say you know, new pictures. Look at this. They are trying to find Hezbollah, uh, Nasrallah. Nasrallah, can you hear me? Fatros. Nasrallah, Nasrallah, yes. I can hear uh, that the uh, indication that Iran tra transferred military equipment to Hezbollah through the Rafiq al Khariri airport. So Israel will. Uh, not stand still. Uh, are they attacking the airport? Maybe soon. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, I don't know. We will see. Look, I, I just we found, can okay, see well, which I just found which I, plan go. the Israeli oh. army, just uh, the IDF, they just posted a video 16 minutes ago. Let us uh, play it. I will play it. Give me a second. Uh, this is from the IDF. Ooh, what is this? Ah, here it says uh, Hezbollah launches service sea missiles, but I think maybe this is, it's six minutes ago, but I think this is like from the archive. It's showing you uh, Hezbollah uh, a weapon before. Yeah, this ah, is. I think it's from the, it's from the second Lebanese war. From uh, 2006. Yeah, yeah, this is an old, but they just posted here 16 minutes ago. You see it? It's just 16 minutes ago. Yeah, this is 16 minutes ago. Yeah, you can see the, the quality of the footage. Yeah, so, yeah, you can tell, yeah. Yeah, it's an old videos. It obviously is recorded by Hezbollah for their propaganda. Well, they are bye bye. Smoke is coming from everywhere. I'm surprised they have electricity. All of those mostly is a private uh, generator because the government is collapsing there. There's no electricity. <clears throat> yeah, but I know they don't have electricity, but uh, everybody, they, like there is private companies, they buy big generators. And then you have to pay the company, local company, like, you know, let's say a person, he bring, uh, okay, it says here, the uh, 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 General Brigade Abbas Nelfar Shawan, the leader of the Brigade of Al-Qudus, he died, he was killed. So the Iranian, they deny, now it's confirmed in Kehan, which is, I believe, Iranian newspaper, that he been killed. Potato. One more to go. So this is the leader of the Al Qudus Brigade. He been cooked. It's confirmed because this is published by the Iranian regime. The Lebanese army, which is not part of this war, thank God is surrounding all the American embassy from every direction so to, to try to protect the American embassy. A Muslim saying, hey Kuffar, wait, 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 Abdul, we say to you, wait. Hmm? You remind me of Allah saying, wait, and I'm waiting with you. Potato. Wait, huh? Potato. All of you potatoes. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, look like, and not only this guy, this brigade, General Brigade Abbas, Colonel Brigade Abbas, 
or generous, sorry. And then other one too is there and he obviously was killed too. I mean, those news, Arabic news is really funny. They just gave two names and both of them, they call him that they are the leader of the Kodos. Kodos, by the way, in Arabic means Jerusalem. It's been holy, sorry, but, uh, uh, but they mean the name of Jerusalem. It's not true. It's a, it's a, they replaced the name of Jerusalem. No, 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 I know. No, no, I'm not saying it's Jerusalem. No, I'm not saying. I'm saying it is the same word they use, the same as we use for Jerusalem. They use the word Qudus, which is mean holy. Yeah, like Ruh al Qudus. Yeah. But it's not Jerusalem, no. Quds. Al Qudus, yeah. But I'm just saying to them that when they say Qudus, they mean they mean Jerusalem. Yes. Look, 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 like look, look, look. Do you see the explosion? Look. So you see the Israeli are not lying. Because when you hit, and then many explosions happen after, look, do you see how the, the explosion happening? So it is true. They are holding up. Look, 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 you see, 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 you see, guys? This is because all the weapon they have is, is exploding. So like you send one one uh, bomb, and then all the bomb they start. Look at the uh, at the cars, people running, running. Yeah, Musrullah, the hero. He said to the Israeli, come, come, I'm waiting for you. Here we go, they are coming to you, potato. Yeah, look, endless number of cars trying to escape. They cannot live in peace. Uh, this guy is saying, Khaled Hassan al-Mahdi, he's a Shia. Every Muslim who do jihad with Hassan Nasrallah, uh, move, move, do something. And then the other one here is making fun. It says, the news says that Hassan Nasrallah, the, the peep peep, he is losing his last breath. Uh, this Muslim is saying, oh Allah, make the bad fight the bad. So he's claiming that the Shia are bad, the Jews are bad, they don't fight each other. Uh... This guy, his name, Hatif, read me, saying, May Allah curse Israel. Allah is a Zionist. You don't oh. know? Uh, didn't Allah, didn't Allah this guy, order Israel? Yeah, th this guy is calling Nasrallah Shawarma. He's exactly what he now. Sh yeah, Shawarma. Potato Shawarma. Right. Yeah. It is shower my time. Oh boy. Shower my everywhere. We give them 11 months to stop this. I know, it, but it's a nothing. mistake. It's a mistake to do so, you know, it's a big mistake, you know. But I think maybe, possibly, I'm not sure, that they were not ready. They don't have enough info, intelligence info, about uh, where they are hiding their weapon, which, if this is true, it's, it's a disaster because that means they are not, uh, you know, doing their job. Somebody is not doing his job. So they have to wait all this time until they collect enough intelligence so they can hit. But look like at least they did a good job. They were able to hunt every one of them. But I think we build this intelligence like 15 or 20 years. I think the most Yeah, but, uh, but if, the, if the intelligence, mm -hmm. I'm not talking about the intelligence community, I'm talking about the information. Yeah. Mm. And look, look, all of this happening, the the uh, the Prime Minister of Lebanon, he says, we are not going to do anything, nothing, nothing, because they have nothing to do with this, you know? The the, the, the Lebanese government, they are, they are useless. Who, who care for, you know, what they say, what they do? So he said, no, we will not do anything. Yeah.
Yeah, until now there is nothing new really. And I'm listening to uh, an Israeli news. They have uh, music, dancing. They have party there. Ah, news, news. Our time to party. It's our time. There's attack on Safad. There's they you shot. Can see, they shot can rocket. See, look, they look, shot rocket at Safad. They uh, shot. Safad. Yeah, Safad. Yeah, shot. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah, they will try to uh, respond, but yes, obviously they are yes. obviously they are farting because if they can do something better, they will do. But we will see. Uh, like Apple, you know, I I, I had a, I had a discussion. I had a discussion with a friend, and uh, uh, like uh, we were sure that's that's how how much the propaganda of Nasrallah was good. Like we were sure that yeah, on the one hand, like we will uh, we we maybe will uh, make a. Uh, Lebanon, uh, like like Netanyahu said, like back to the Stone Age because uh, because of Hezbollah, but then but then like uh, but but they will destroy Tel Aviv, but so far I mean if they're shooting at Sfat, I mean what we have in Sfat, we don't have anything in Sfat. Yeah, but you know, <laughs> uh, uh, I think what the Israeli are, uh, government under now is doing is smart because you don't want to make all the end Lebanese your enemy. There's people they are against you. So it's good to focus only in yeah. your enemy, because if you start attacking others who they have nothing to do with this, you will lose everybody. Now of everybody, course, when when, yeah. he, when 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 he said back to the Stone Age, he meant like uh, uh, because if you remember uh, in 2006 when the Second Lebanese War happened. Nasrallah, when he came back to the from the bunker, he said like uh, if he knew. That the result will be so devastating, then he, he yeah, would, yeah. He, he would yeah, he have said, never. Uh, he said his famous yeah. sentence, "If I know," and the people start laughing at him. And now is the same, "If I know." Well, now it's too late. And, to and know. of course, and and believe me, I know. I know that there are a lot of good people in Lebanon. Like again, one of my best friends that I met in the army uh, is a is a Maronite. And uh, he has, he still has family in Lebanon. So obviously, like, uh, it's a very like for people like him, it's like it's very, it's a, it's a very hard situation. Like I, I'm, I don't envy him, because it's dangerous. Yeah. Well, let us see what will happen. We hope things will be good. Now I'm thinking, guys, to finish for today. I'm here for many, many hours, and uh, I hate to leave you. You know, especially after I learned how to make the mojo. Let me make one mojo. Hold on. Look at this one. All right. Hey, Sheikh Yomad, how are you, brother? How are you doing? Yeah, uh, by the way, those people do not know how to do this mojo. Nasrallah, he was my favorite mojo. Okay, news, news. They are attacking again Safad. Mufti Merid. Yeah, they are send, sending rocket uh, from Hezbollah. Yeah, so you see, still they have little, you know, they will they will try to bother you. This why hit, hit hard. Yeah. Don't have mercy on the cowards. Yeah, those mojo actually they were not exist in Discord until before today. But I did my black magic, Harut and Marut. Uh, I wish I have baklava for me. You know, I don't know what I have in the fridge actually. Let me see what I have. I think I have nothing. I, I think I will eat tuna and make some rice. Not like you spoil people. Yeah, I put Mojo, everybody start copying me. Yeah, you know, people, they copy you. You know? I don't know. Let us see here. <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> I mean, the one who made those... Uh, this, is, this is Hezbollah fighters now. 
פיו, לא נעים. ותהי איתו. You run, run for your life, potato. The Jews are covered, right? Okay, let us see. Do you see how many hundred million Abdul? They are watching. They don't even dare to fart. Yeah, that's why there's a song. It says, potato, 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 potato. There's a song actually, by the way. I have actually copyright over it. It's not made by me, but I asked permission a long time ago from the owner, and I they sent me an email, but I don't remember where I have it, to use the song. I used to use it for the Abdul when they run from me. Um, yeah. Yeah, until now there's no news. It's repeating the same thing. So we have to wait, you know, a couple of hours. Look, look at the fire is coming. This is in the port area. Ah, they are attacking now. See, they are attacking ships belong to Hezbollah in the port. You see it? This is in the port. Yeah. It's getting more exciting. Betito, 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 All right, all right. Sound good. Ooh. I know this thing here is confusing with this area. I'm trying to find out which area is that. You know those cowards, they are even hiding weapons between Christians' areas without permission from the Christians. They knew that the Israeli were not attacked because here it looked like there's a, there's a, a statue of Mary. So it's possible that this is a Christian area here. And Hezbollah is hiding weapon there, right? I'm trying to figure out where is that. All right. The Israeli army says they made a very precise strike against Hezbollah. Uh, they attacked the area of al Ki in South Beirut. Well, guys, let us see in a few hours from now what will happen. I really apologize. I wish I can stay with you. Uh, it's time for me to go and... Uh, Eat. Yeah, I just uh, I just want to say that uh, everyone here and uh, like in chat to pray for our uh, uh, brother, our Lebanese brothers in Christ that are like uh, in a very dangerous situation now. That's all. They will be fine. Amen. Don't worry. They will be fine. They are, they are used to it. Those people are fighting. Amen. Amen. Yeah. The, the, this Christ is... will rule Lebanon. Yeah. We'll but... see that. Yeah, thank you very much, all of you guys, and I hope soon we will meet again, maybe in a few hours if I could, and we will hear even better news to confirm the good news for us. I wish I can stay with you guys. I really apologize. I'm not getting tired, but I want to play with the mojo. Mojo, mojo. Bye-bye, Habibi. Mojo, mojo. I mean, I don't believe it. I have mojos around. Like, what? I don't know what I'm missing in my life, you know? Now I know why people, they go in the elevator, they have mojo. They go in the street, they are working on mojo. People are chatting, they are using mojo. I don't know how important the mojo in our life. Now I know. It was the light came with the missile of Israel over Hassan Nasrallah. Open it, make me see. I was blind before today. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. So God bless you all. And we hope soon we will hear more news. But look like this guy is dead. Let us hope so. 
Uh, I would try to come back in a few hours if I could. Should I come back in a few hours, people? Okay, as long as you guys you want to come back, I'm not coming. <laughs> I get you busted, get you busted. Crazy people, you know, you think I would do what you do? I'm stubborn. Never tell me what to do. Learn from Hassan Nasrallah. Hey, Dave, I'm not talking to you, okay? I'm talking to them, you know. This, I'm, this is not about you. Just forget it. You want me to leave, Idaf? I will leave. You want me to stay? I will stay. I'm talking to them. Don't take it seriously. Yeah, okay, thank you. Yeah, you can't you can't play with those people. All right. So I want to say thank you all. May the Lord bless you and until we see you soon again. God is good, so is Jesus. And those who live by the sword shall die by the sword. I mean to that. Take care.